Hey guys, welcome to the last part of the Crossbow series. This one was the Energy Shaper, and I thought I would have a little bit more fun with it, like poke him from really far away with the beam, and then, you know, just go in for the usual poke. But it ended up being a lot harder to actually land the beam than I thought, and it was just, it moves so slow when you rotate. And for some reason, the Energy Shaper was extremely expensive, so what I ended up doing was just crafting it myself. I brought it down to like, I think it was 25,000 to, to craft in everything. Now if you do end up, you know, wanting to try out this weapon, it's better to craft it yourself. You are going to have to get um, tier 3 sword crafting, I think, in order to get to the crossbows, but it's not that hard to get. So that's all I wanted to toss in there for now. Enjoy the slaughter. Thank <laughs> you. 
this last fight had a kind of a sad ending. If I'd played a little bit more safe, I probably would have won that, but, you know, it happens. You know, I think one of the things I'm glad about this series is that it brings weapons that you would never see in throughout the dungeons, you know? People, like, probably never fought these weapons ever, and thanks to the series, I'm actually bringing them to light, you know? I think it's pretty cool. Anyways, that's it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.